Hendrix and the Westerlies. Hi, everybody. Uh, my name is Haley, and I have had the great fortune of collaborating with the Westerlies, but um, we thought it would be fun to split up the set. Of I'm going to do a song, and they're going to do a song, and then we'll show you things we've been working on together. So. I'm going to play a song called Seed of a Seed, which is secretly about how every generation feels like they're doing things better the last one um, and um, I think we all just have a lot more growing to do that's all this is quite a production I've never played in such a large alley in my life <laughs> sometimes like I need a silent mind in a consumer flood and if I'm lucky maybe a glass of wine if I get lucky maybe a hand next to mine some free time No, if we don't know better If we don't know better Well, did my parents' parents know better, better No, but they tried sung by the Westerlies, then I will be back. Goodbye. Thank you. How about it one more time for Haley Hendricks? Haley Hendricks. We are the Westerlies. It's so wonderful to be here. We've been on the road the past three weeks with Haley sharing all this music. Um, and you all are going to get our most emotional set because this is the last night of our run together. So uh, buckle up. <laughs> uh, we're going to play an old English folk song. This is called Cero. Bye. 
I'm sure you're probably thinking how a weirdo like me tricked these incredible brass players to putting up with an out-of-tune guitar. And I ask myself every day how I got this lucky. Um, I don't know. But it is our last day of tour, so it is extra bittersweet. So we're going to show you some songs that we've worked on together several years ago. And now, uh, just in case you know of my music, you've probably came to just see this one song, so I'm going to play that one song for you now. So this song has to do with bugs and uh, collecting them. Maybe it's a metaphor, I don't know. Okay. Let's, let's get going. There's a centipede naked in your bedroom. Oh, when you swear to God, the fucker's out to get you. Oh, when I digress, cause I must make you the perfect morning. I try my best. Scoop the slugger out the window And there's a prey Prancing on your bathtub Oh, when you swear he's a priest From a past life out to get you Oh, when I digress Cause I must make you the perfect morning I try my best Priest inside a gym jar. And there's a millipede angry on your carpet. Perfect morning. I try my best. To prove that nothing's out to get you. Everybody. Um, I think just to clear my nerves, I want to say I'm a little out of my element. I'm from Portland, Oregon. I'm in Washington, D.C. right now. That's pretty insane to me. Right? Um, I've only been here twice, once to play at the, the 930 Club, which is a dark dungeon and beautiful, and then uh, the other time was to almost pee my pants playing the tiny desk. So I just being here makes me sweat a lot. Um, Especially seeing you all in daylight. They keep the musicians in the dungeons, you know? We don't see daylight usually, so this is very intimate. 
And this song is also very intimate. This song is called Melanin, and I wanted to put my angst um, into a melodic form, uh, being very confused with my identity in this country. Um, so I just thought it would be easier in a melody to put all of my angst and anger and sadness in the westerlies help me get to that space. So let's go there. How did we get this far? Mm, how did we get this far? Melanin spoiled and blackberry curls in my eyes burn. Remembering the earth is a blood so. That is a good thing to do. This is Andy Clausen on the trombone. This is Addison May Saxon on the trombone. Last but not least, we got Chloe Rollins on the trumpet. And I am your host, Haley Hendricks, and I just d don't like being on TV. I couldn't don't have the cameras, but that's what the deal was. And that's okay. So hello to those streaming at home, but I'm sweating profusely. So excellent. <laughs> And thank you, operators, for putting up with me. It's, it's also pretty warm up here. It is. Is it? Maybe it's the best. Uh -huh. <laughs> Could be. But um, I have also tricked four of some of the best 
brass players in the world to sing backup vocals on a very dorky song. So this song is about existential dread. It is called Um Shalala. We would like to sing it with you. If you feel uh, so drawn to want to also sing along, that is great. But if not, don't worry about it. And this, just pretend a drum kit is in the background though, just for fun. I think I've listed everything that makes me anxious. Now I can really sink in now, okay. This carpet is also stressful though. The milk is sour. I've barely been to college and I've been doubtful of all that I have dreamed of the brink of my existence essentially is a comedy the gap in my teeth and all that I can cling to the milk is sour Shalala, um, um, shalala oh. Um, shalala, um, um, shalala Cute, um, shalala, um, um, um I messed up the song Um, shalala, um the milk is sour I've barely been to college and I've been doubtful Of all that I have dreamed of The brink of my existence essentially is a comedy The gap in my teeth and all that I can cling to The milk is sour Shalala, um, um, shalala Um, shalala, um, um, shalala Um, shalala, um, um, shalala Again, essentially is a comedy. The gap in my teeth, and all that I can cling to the milk is sour. Shalala, um, um, shalala, um, shalala, um, um, shalala, um, shalala, um, um, shalala, ah, shalala, um, um, shalala. If you don't go outside, nothing's going to happen. She'll never write her number on a crumpled up napkin. And she'll never see our ego. And she'll never be abandoned. And she'll never get to eat you like your heart's a pomegranate. And I'm throwing out the milk. The olives got old. I'm tired of my mind getting heavy with mold. I need to start a garden. I need to start a garden. I need to start a garden. I'm gonna start a garden in my backyard I'm gonna start a garden in my backyard Cause making this song up was just as hard Cause making this song up was just as hard Ooh, shalala, ooh, ooh, shalala Of the oldies, but let's let's do let's try some newies now. Speaking of the carpet, I feel like it's a very high static electricity risk walking around here. Anybody else getting shocked a lot? <laughs> Everyone's testing. I see. That's good. Did it Be work? Careful. Did you shock? Okay. <laughs> I see. I think it just has a feeling of authority or something, I don't know, with the, the red carpet. It's I've complained about everything. We're actually very grateful to be here. And this was a free show. <laughs> that makes me very happy. That's fantastic. It was a free show, right? Good, thank God. Okay, good. <laughs> well, this song, uh, transitioning from those songs uh, were written in my 20s, where I felt a lot of angst and woe is me. And now that I'm in my 30s, I'm just feeling a lot of, whoa. Mm -hmm. So I'm um, in this whoa space. I am writing more songs about gratitude. So that's what this song is about. 
Here we go. Start to really appreciate that you could call your pop or friend and not bail on the thing the next Tuesday because it's a new day. It's a What memories do you have of being in DC? What does it feel like being here again? Well, the last time I was on the stage, I was a uh, junior in high school, so it's kind of a, a tripping back here. You played on this exact stage when you were, wow. <laughs> it is weird. I was on this exact stage when I was a junior in college, and I must confess, a horrible crime was committed. I was wearing a jazz hat. <laughs> What do we think about the legality of this jazz vest you've got? (laughs) (laughs) For the court to determine. Okay. Well, Chloe brought up the wonderful idea of covering a song by one of our favorite songwriters, Connie Converse. And if you've not heard of Connie's music, holy cannoli, it's the real thing. It's really beautiful. So I feel honored to sing over this track. It's called One by One.
can't tell if you're having a good time. So that I, okay, okay, I see that. All right, thank you. And I, I think it's just the distance. I will get over my self-consciousness. It's so sweet to be here. This song is called Mouth of a Flower. I'm just throwing images at the wall of a song. So. of a flower A hummingbird waits Guarding his morsel As he takes and he takes and he takes The muscle underwater The seagull's plate The tide rolling after As it takes and it takes and it takes And we take and we take and we take And we take and we tick, tick, tick The huckleberry climber The soul of a lot The golden cord, the worry of 
a mother The creaking of a gate Do ghosts get hungry Cause they take and they take and they take Of a father, King Solomon on lived, lived out through his daughter to the golden court. The muscle underwater, the algae in bloom. What more could he offer? What more to do? Of a flower, the hummingbird waits, guarding her morsel as she takes and she takes and she takes. And we take and we take and we take, and we take and we take and we take. I'm going to treat myself to a sip. So last night we had a Maryland state representative, was it, or legislature? A member of the Maryland state uh, legislature in the front row of the show wearing Old Bay seasoning socks. <laughs> Stood out like a sore thumb. So I'm curious, do we have any elected officials here tonight? <laughs> or members of the judiciary? Is the president here? <laughs> he didn't make it? OK. <laughs> we saved him a seat. Is this the time for an improv song? Do you think that's too? Weird, it, it's, it doesn't feel, later, later, let's do it later, let's go. The song is called Moss Hands, written in the time period of the early pandemic where we were definitely not allowed to even do stuff like this. So I like to play it as a reminder that it is a miracle that we can still be in spaces like this and we shouldn't take it for granted, it's really nice. You could bump into a stranger, you could bump into your ex, you could bump into a colleague, you just like live art and meeting in person is, is the best. So let's, let's celebrate it. And even though you do reach out, I 
neglect my fault And even though it's so nice out We stay in a room And isn't it mad to see have time for a couple more. Um, this song is about a deep dream that I have of getting to move to the Redwoods one day. Um, but I am someone who lives in a modern city and don't have enough skills. <laughs> and uh, it's about my friend Lewis making fun of me. And I hope one day to have enough skills, but right now I have only whittled a couple spoons. And I have a long way to go. I'm going to take... Ten more seconds to tune, though. So, Westerlies, if you have any thoughts on homesteading, or <laughs> if you want me to sit in the pain of this moment <laughs> with 500 strangers. I'm afraid to say, I think you, you probably have more outdoor skills than all of the Westerlies combined. We're yeah, Brooklynites, yeah. <laughs> we're, we're city but landlubbers. What's the equivalent of that for cities? I don't know. City slickers. City slicker. I just know how to water plants. That's about it. <laughs> I have a backyard, but I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> Throw some seeds. That'll be good. The rats will get them. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> okay, Redwood song. This song's also about how I believe that plants can talk to us and I'm a dirty hippie and yes, that's what it's also about. My God, my ancient God Well, I couldn't believe what the water had told me That man and plant had used to talk Men, I do anything to hear the redwoods talk. And my God, my ancient God. Well, I couldn't believe what the walnut tree and nettle leaf told me. That man and bird had used to sing. But now the only man here is cell phone ring, ring, rings. Do, 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 do. 
Bugs want to talk with us, 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 do, 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 do. A jumbotron with our faces on it up there. Is it? No. There is. There is. Oh my gosh. I thought. Oh, can I see. Take, <laughs> can yeah. take a picture so I can send it to my mom? Okay, Addison would like a picture for his mom if you would like. She's already watching the live stream. Oh, she is. <laughs> wow. Okay. That gains a greater context. We are rock stars. <laughs> All right. We've made it. Westerlies. So this is it. I thought that was just for the live stream, and I saw everyone looking up, and I wondered. Like, like there are, must be a lot of ads up there. Okay. Well, speaking of mothers, this is a head nod to my mother. Maybe she's watching the live stream too. Who knows? But um, she made a lot of weird sacrifices to be a tiny Filipino lady to move to the States. And I'm grateful for those weird choices she made for a weirdo like me to get to sing about it much later. So this song is called Swoop. And there's a head nod to my grandma too. And it feels good, so let's let us swoop. After I tune for just one more gentle moment. Because we are in DC, dang it. Might as well be in tune. For this DC song, this is all DC tuning. Just DC, 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 D. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. Rises and falls 
Brave, brave was the girl who had moved from Hong Kong, where her voice was returning. The mind begins burning to know what's beyond a day, 'cause there's an artistry to go in. Plump was the child she would grow, and I know it all. It's true, it's me. Strange, strange from the times we would know as the cell phone. Well, don't tempt me with longing. Don't tempt me with marketing. I won't buy it today. Cause there's an artistry in the day, the day, the day, the day. Grandmother's grave. Sweet, sweet is the peace that I feel in the North Plains, where the soil is returning, the mud begins burning to know what's beyond today. Is there an artistry to feeling? Is there an artistry in the day, the day, the day, the day? And there's an artistry to go in with. To say, I think we only have time for one more. We have a strict time limit today, so this is this is a, our last song. But uh, unfortunately, I also have to tune to get to it. So, Westerlies, do you have any thoughts? And also, oh my gosh, we've been on the road three weeks. We started in Iowa City. We we saw the transition of winter to, to spring it's as we slowly went south. It was really beautiful. And, but if you have any thoughts, I am gonna. <laughs> Should we do random memories from the past three weeks? Yeah. We saw we saw Caitlin Clark on the street when we were in Iowa City. That was cool. I'll just say I can think of no better way to ring in spring than getting to play this music with Haley every night. Oh, thank you. Well, the best bandmate award goes to Andy tonight. Thank you. That's <laughs> brownie points. <laughs> That means I, a lot. I think when we toured in 2022, we crossed the fall equinox as well. So we can only tour around the equinox. Yes, or solstices. That sounds good. I like that. But yes, we've made a beautiful body of music, but it is not released yet. So in the near future, we will be releasing an album's worth of music that we're excited to share. But we heard a lot of that too. 
please, please check out the West Release. They've made some incredible records. They're one of my favorite bands, and over the last five, six years, I've just tricked them into being my friends and also bandmates. But they have amazing records out. Please check it out. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna end you, end this, end this tour, end, end myself. So just kidding. Then end this song. This song is called Untitled God's Song. Thanks for listening to my ramblings. That was a poor use of language. shoes are all dressed up and she spins me around like a marionette oh my web is still spinning my web is still spinning my web is still spinning you can't see it yet thick hips and big lips and the button she's pressing she speaks every language shift A right B Nintendo 63 I'm her video baby the game she's been changing The quick glimpse of heaven Forgetting her headlights are on When you misread her fortune Don't misread the joke She's the note on your lampshade The honeycomb Holding you Holding me too For joining us at Millennium Stage. For more information about the upcoming Millennium Stage programming, please visit us online at our website or on Facebook. 
At this time, we ask that you would exit the seating area so we can safely clear the area. If you would like to meet with the artist, you may do so at the back of the house. Again, at this time, we ask that you would exit the seating area so we can safely clear the area. Thank you, and we hope you enjoy the rest of your evening at the Kennedy Center.